What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another trailer reaction review. Today we're going to be checking out the Pokemon Masters reveal, gameplay reveal, or whatever they're going to show us. It's going live in about a minute or so, and they're going to be showing us, a, a, like they said, eight minutes on Serbi, which is going to show us, hopefully, what this game is going to be about. I'm super excited. It's my first video back after the, all the E3 stuff, and of course, after what happened this past week. But let's jump into this Pokemon Masters reaction and I'll pray that it's going to be good because right now I'm mixed feelings on it. I'm, while I was excited for it on the presentation that they showed, it, to me it still feels like it needs, they need to show us exactly what we're going to be doing in the game before me to be like pull the trigger and like want to actually spend time and money because who knows, it could look good on paper and not be good. You know what I'm saying? So let's put on the headphones. The relationship between Pokemon and their trainers with the help of a tool called a Pokeball. The relationship between the creatures and the humans is strong in the world, regardless of the age and gender. The Pokemon can manifest the power of the Pokemon for both humans and beginning. All right, okay, okay. Uh, Pokemon has a preference, types of color, shape, and influence. Choose the Pokemon each. All right, they didn't say that we're gonna have to read a ton. For example, Erica, who's a gym leader from the Kanto region, looks like she can teach a flower or a drink, but she doesn't seem like she. Pokemon, I hope the fun of collecting is not just Pokemon, but different types of training and new of the world. Jesus Christ, that went like hella fast. Faster than I thought. DNA, the Pokemon company. Oh, we getting a full cinematic trailer. Like, let's go Pikachu, huh? Okay. I smell a budget already. Okay. What is this, the Gala region? We get Gen... Gen 8 Pokemon in this? What is this? No. The homies. Woo! The art style. Look at it. Let's go, yes. Scotland. Ooh, voice acted and all that. I accept your the challenge. Go, help out. The opening it's cinematic. Perfect. Let's go, Scotland. Doing damage. So we are going to have... I don't know if it was confirmed, but that's... We got a um, Gen 7 Pokemon, I think. Ooh, it looks so good. But this is not obviously this is true. Pokemon Masters. <laughs> okay. They come coming out with an anime? <laughs> What's going on? But the art style is beautiful though, I'm not gonna lie. It looks super clean. I see this is Brock, Shorty. And it looks like, I guess, the new trainer for the thing. Oh, the Rotom phone. Okay. The bad team. The one we fight. Our turn. Oh, no. Erica. Keep it up. Um, okay. A whole bunch of gym leaf trainers look like gym leaf from over the years. I forgot the other two shows. Right? Oh, okay. My son caught him. Like, oh, okay. You can be able to heal Pokemon, obviously. This is dope. Like, what are they like? Are we gonna get like anime shorts? <laughs> like, well done for the story missions and stuff like that. You did it. Yeah. That's cool. They switched it to a guy trainer now. Talking to Erica, right? You see you? Look at him. Okay. We're gonna be able to like chill our Pokemon outside of battles, maybe. Like what? Why are they showing all this? Like, what's it built? There we go. That's what it's built. All over the world are gathering in Pasio and forming new teams. Let's go. Is Red gonna say anything? I'll show everyone that I'm the best. And professors. We're fighting professors. Team Rocket. I have to prove that my team is the strongest. Oh, okay. Some of these are um I'm not immediately identifying. Who's that? 
okay. This is fly. This is fly. I'm not gonna lie. The art style is like what got me more excited. Like, I'll be down if they did an anime season of this. This is cool. Okay. Hello. Hey. I'm Ishihara from the Pokemon Company. What's up, Ishihara? What did you think of the animated trailer? We hope you enjoyed dope. our effort to capture the world of Pokemon Masters. And you did it, bro. That was pretty good. We've created this world in the form of a smartphone game. Mm -hmm. Comments from Mr. Sugimori of Game Freak appeared at the beginning of this video. This okay. original artwork for the game was the also created by Mr. Sugimori. Pokemon Masters cool. started with an idea from Mr. Sugimori, who is one of the okay, original many creators say of many captivating <laughs> Pokemon trainers. The idea was to create a gameplay experience where you could befriend not only Pokemon, but also trainers to battle alongside you. In this way, we added new depth to the world of Pokemon. New depth? DNA or new ways to sell us have been Pokemon and trainers and stuff new like type that. of Pokemon games. Now, we'll hear the latest information about Pokemon Masters from okay. Mr. Sasaki, the producer on the game from DNA. Sasaki! Take it away, Mr. From Sasaki. From DNA, okay. Have we met him before? Hello. No. I'm Sasaki Look from at DNA so, Company Limited. Sweater. I'm the producer of Pokemon fly. Masters. Vasan looked like the person the you wanted to chill with you had over. The artificial island of Casio is the setting for this game. Into like a, Somewhere a in the world of Pokemon. Somewhere in the world of Pokemon. Okay. Casasio. Looks dope. Yes. Pokemon trainers are aiming to become the trainers. champion of a tournament called the Pokemon Masters League, which is being held on Pasio. Okay. Give us an animated series island, with these Trainers have a single Pokemon that travels around with them as their partner. These that? duos are called Sync Pairs. Throughout the story, the main character will meet trainers who have appeared in past Pokemon video games and form a team with other Sync Pairs. And to qualify for the Pokemon Masters League, they embark on an adventure, collecting badges along the way. Oh, okay, we collect badges. That's dope. Oh, and we fight the unique thing <laughs> about Pokemon battles in this game is that they are 3-on-3 three three. Three team battles oh, okay. in real time. Players unleash attacks as quickly as possible by using the move gauge, which fills as time passes. Okay. There are also special it looks moves amazing. called sync it looks moves, like which make battles a whole lot more exciting. Sync moves, okay. Not Z moves, but Another sync special moves. feature of this game is that Pokemon are not the only ones using moves. Trainers use them too. Trainers provide support in battle by using moves that heal Pokemon or raise oh, okay. their stats. Right. Pokemon Masters allows you to make your own dream team with trainers from past Pokemon video games and try to become the champion. Was that, um, Shorty? Oh, something from X and Y and, um, Sun and Moon? We got everybody here. Shorty from... With Pokemon, Pokemon Masters, Crystal? Was that the we're Crystal? aiming to create a game that lets anyone casually pick up their phone and enjoy Pokemon battles. Casuals. The release is planned for, for summer of 2019. Oh, we're currently close. working hard to make a game that people all over the world can have fun with. We'll keep you up to date with the latest info on the official website and social media accounts. I hope you're looking forward to the release. That's all for today's presentation. Thanks for watching. That's it. Give us a cinematic tendon. Give us something. One more thing. Sword and Shield trailer. <laughs> no. Give us something. Guess what? They didn't give us anything extra at the end. So. Thoughts. It looked pretty clean. Still have I still have way more fucking questions. I want to know how they're gonna fucking monetize this. How are we gonna be able to pick our Pokemon? How are we gonna be able to pick these trainers? The stuff I want to know. I want to see not somebody playing it. At least go through the menus and you know do stuff. So. I feel like when they um and it's 
different people, different strokes with different folks. When they showed off Animal Crossing, they showed off the Animal Crossing mobile game. They they did a whole direct and they deep dived in it. And the same thing with Fire Emblem. Nintendo like f- fully fleshed out on how the game was going to work. Now, this is the Pokemon company doing their own style of direct, quote unquote. And I guess they kind of, to me, it misses the mark because it's like, if you're going to give us eight minutes, eight minutes of gameplay but i guess they wanted to highlight that cinematic with the gameplay stuff that they showed which was dope but i felt like they leaned too much on that dope cinematic but not actual shit we're gonna be doing in the game if it's releasing this summer show us what we're gonna be doing in the game um mind you we still probably have time to see exactly what they're gonna be doing you know till the game launches um it started off very weak with this um like text-based stuff they could have had somebody talking over it narrating it um and then it jumped into a beautiful beautiful art drawn cinematic of like basically everything we want out of a pokemon anime on top of everything we want from a pokemon game besides the three on three aspect because that aspect it still feels foreign to me and i want to play it and dive into it before i get my you know real thoughts and impressions on it but it looks pretty good visually this opening cinematic was a great way to showcase the stuff that we're going to be doing in the game i appreciated that they you know they got the dope artists from a dope pokemon era to do all the art and redraw all these characters Characters and draw them in a way that an art style that we know and love and not lean on the newer art style that looks kind of weirdish just kind of feels rooted in the Pokemon world which is pretty good and it, it feels rooted into the Pokemon games as well then it jumped over to the gameplay and the gameplay again it complements the art style they showed because it's not it's not too different it kind of plays off it we get the world at the end we get the trainers we get blue red cynthia we got sun over here from fucking um omega ruby alpha sapphire i'm not sure where the other trainer is from but this is is so it looks so clean i'm just wondering how we're going to be able to pick the trainers and pick the pokemon and then we see on that we got to go through some some routes you see trainers on these routes you see the ace trainer in the back the the regular school kid up front so i'm thinking we're going to have to battle these trainers along to get towards wherever the goal is would would be the place that we're going to have this competition at we got the girl ghost girl from um generation seven i forget the ghost girl name the one with the mimikyu totem pokemon and that it looks so dope it looks so dope it actually the sprites look like um uh, sun moon sprites which (laughs) is funny with all the drama that's going on right now with the sword and shield games but it's like jesus christ it looks like they just pulled the sprites straight out of sun and moon and threw them in here but they do look clean they do have them black borders around them which is like ucky to me but it does look clean well, next to the trainers the trainers look like all brand new sprites well at least some of them but they still have the black borders too but it's a phone game and it's going to be a f- from what we know it's going to be a free phone game and we have to do in-app purchases and stuff like that and you can skip these animations with the big skip button you see on the bottom pokemon sync moves sync moves again just a gimmick to be in the game it looks like um uh, z moves dynamaxing all the same shit just a move that you could do in the game that's going to be super powerful to help you out and then they also said that trainers could do moves and stuff like that to me pretty cool pretty cool trailer if i had to grade the trailer in a total I would have to, the cinematic is dope. So I would have to give it a five for the cinematic. But I do wish, I, I just like, it's like, ugh. The only reason I would take away points is because they didn't show too much gameplay, but they did show gameplay. And the gameplay they should did show was solid and was cool. Let me know in the comment section below your thoughts on everything that they showed. I think it's pretty cool. There's definitely be something that I'm going to be covering here on the channel. I'm going to be going through my first gameplay impressions and stuff and playing it with you guys. If you want to see content like that, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button if you enjoy the video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next trailer reaction review. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter, and you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube, and yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos just like this one. So if you enjoy, please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.